Nia just lost her fucking mind. <laughs> in the store, we're in, um... Oh, first of all, Chinatown turned out to be awesome. When we first showed up there, I was shocked because of the area we were in. Everything was boarded up. There was just stragglers hanging around. The only people around were um, kind of like leftover people from like some kind of war or something. It was fun, weird. Well, you've seen it the first, the first video. And then um, when we found that area, and I've been to that area millions of times, um, but I didn't know it was all, all those places are new. We found that little shopping area with new stores, that bookstore, that um, antique shop we went into. I gotta film it there next time, so it was awesome. We got off the bus and we go into to, uh, 7 Eleven. There's two people working. One of them's flirting with some guys. And there's other girls just staring at us. We're like, are you open? And she's staring at us, like, are you open? And then we're both standing there going, are you open? So then Nia fucking lost her mind on him. You, you told her you're going to uh, fight her after work, too. Yeah, I said, wait, I Yeah, you. He started talking in pigeon and just fucking was hilarious. Because she said she's sleeping. <laughs> it was so funny. And she was being sarcastic. Yeah, yeah, she. Like, never like next. I can have the next person. Nope, nope. Well, she was open the whole time. Just right. she was just. I think I don't know. She was either being just a bitch or trying to avoid having okay. to register, like to... Yeah, to, but you can still say next. Yeah, oh, just say at, next, or yeah. just say like, you yeah, know... Just stare out like you're still Right, right, stupid. right. Like she's, I was looking she, into her eyes. She's like... Just staring. Like, dude, we're asking you, can we buy this? And then when you mentioned, look, oh, we didn't know you opened, you weren't being a dick, she just instantly started being sarcastic. Almost like she knew. She, yeah, knew, what she, she, knew. she knew what she was doing. She just wants to act like, oh, I didn't know. I guess I must be tired or something, she said. And then that's when you had a fucking epic meltdown on her. It's funny. Because now I know you're just being a... Like, yeah, be just being... Yeah, exactly, exactly. Funny stuff. But what, Chinatown was good though, right? Chinatown was awesome. Yeah, it was fun. We had a good time. We couldn't find anywhere to eat though. It's the only problem we had uh, with eating. We'll have to find a place next time to eat. But um, we usually, that's what we usually go down there and do, is eat somewhere. Not this time, no, but it was cool. It was good. Um, it was good to see the, uh, that there is an area that, that you can go to that, that does have cool stuff. Look at that. It's made out of wheel, uh, wheelchair. Yeah, he's a homeless dude. He cruises around. But he what is that wheelchair? He doesn't what stop at the for? light zone. He almost always kills someone. What is that wheelchair? It's like a, I don't know. Some kind of contraption. Attention seeker. Yeah, attention seeker. Yeah, it's um. Wait. Homeless ingenuity. Oh, it's a homeless invention. He's like a homeless inventor. Oh, he's, like he's he's like the Tesla of the homeless people. Nice. Yeah. Yeah, he always crazy. fucking rides around. He almost kills people too. Did you say Tesla? Of course, of course. That's how that works. Yeah, but yeah, I'll, I'll be going back down there and to do a deeper dive on the actual buildings. I'm, I'm gonna try to do like a couple at a time and um, try to shoot uh, inside the places too. I, you know, I think you just ask people, they're usually pretty cool about it. The guy in the antique place, I, I ended up taking a lot of pictures in there. Um, I know, right? I love it. How you doing? Yeah, well, you see this area every single day anyway, so now let's just look at it here. We're doing it. I try to take a different path, but sometimes when I, as soon as I leave the house, I start like... Oh, who? Oh, down there? No, no. What is this place? What are they building here? Oh, I don't know. Something. Used to be our first Hawaiian bank. Yeah, those was, was Quicksilver was yeah, over here too. Yeah, they're redoing it. Maybe a restaurant. I don't know. Uh, it could be one of those F scale stuff. Across over here? Yeah. Oh, yeah. easier to deal with. Usually when the light goes and you got to walk, someone comes flying up here and plows in you and with a bike almost all the time. Oh, we came to the street yesterday. I think. We came down here the other night. Yeah. This is where the kid got caught over here. Right, very windy, very windy. 
Which way you want to go? Uh, let's go this way. Let's all go up this way. Less people. Yeah. Which? Oh, um, go this way, yeah. That's that's awful. It's awful. Oh, it's it's. Well, the creative creativity is going away because it's all Satanism. No, look at the original. Look at the. That's like polka dot man. No, that two two year old can do the same. Guys, really? This is where we're at. This is where we're at. This is uh 2023. Yeah, they're all polka dots. Yeah, that's where we're at. My quantum attention, you know, when I put my attention on something, you know what happens, yes, right? That whole window is full of people now. <laughs> it's so magnetic. It is, because everything, and I say that to people sometimes when I'm out here and it's not like a fucking crazy person, but you see it. Yes. Whenever I'm like, oh, look at that. Next thing I know, everybody, it's a but quantum they thing. Fall up out of yeah, they fall out of the trees to kind of to, to get on my back. Well, let me get it. Oh, no. Something exciting. <laughs> It's coming soon. Yeah, that is real exciting. Yeah, it's called duty free shopping. Yeah, it's called more duty free uh, uh, shopping. Wow, that's exciting. This was closed up since really before the pandemic. They closed this up when they were gonna when they thought there was gonna be crazy BLM riots that never happened. We can grab uh, burgers if you want. Yeah, burgers. wanna do that? Okay. This way, which way. Which way you wanna go? We're going straight. Let's go here. We go to Duke's Lane. Yeah, I'll go to the And then we'll get your cheeseburger. Yeah, I haven't had one of those in ages. Yeah. It's a long, long time. Oh, they have sweet potato fries. Yeah, I like those too. Those are good. Yeah. I thought we were basically just going to go down to Chinatown and eat, basically, and just got to fuck off. But uh, it's good that we got to walk around a lot more. Well, I just yeah. want... That was more like a recon day. I want to go down and just see the lay of the land. Next time we eat there. Yeah, we'll eat. We don't want to be there too late. Right, yeah, you don't, once the sun goes down there. We woke up a little too late today. Yeah, we want to go at 10 o'clock, right? I woke up a little too late. Yeah, yeah, I woke up at 10, you were still fast asleep, so I, I said, well. Yeah, I woke up at 1.15. Yeah, yeah, I got up then at 12, and I waited for you. It's okay. I wasn't waiting on the lady, though. I was just waiting on a friend. I'm not waiting on the lady. Oh, that's that place. We went to this place yesterday, I got like... Four chicken strips on six. I have the picture. I'll put it up there. It was twenty bucks for for a little rice and some uh, chicken strips. And it wasn't a lot. It no, was it was nothing. It was, I ate it in like five seconds. I know times are hard. I get that, but come on, man. The chicken was flat. Yeah, it was like dry. It was dry little no. four little sticks of dried chicken on top of like ten perfectly laid out pieces of shredded cabbage on the bottom so you wouldn't see the container and like a, a couple yeah. scoops of rice 20 bucks oh and then three dollars for a, a little bit of extra sauce in a huge container <laughs> they gave the huge container to to just to buy the three dollars i guess but that's what nah, i don't feel like i don't want to deal with the place i don't know today all right that's how, that's a sad thing that's why i'll, I'll, I'll never branch out I'll never branch out because the thing is, like, when I see a place that I haven't been to, eat before. This is Mediterranean. What? McDonald's. Oh, I know. Why did I want McDonald's? I think it's because I had started having Chinatown like flashbacks. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I used to eat at McDonald's down there back before I knew what was in it. Big Kids. Um, oh, yeah. 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 I tell you, the last time I had it. Uh, it was good, and then I felt like I had a brick in my stomach. The wind out here is... It's pretty fucking crazy, right? The wind is insane. It's insane. It's never this windy, though. When is it this windy? Yeah, no, I don't, I don't remember the last time it was this windy. It's been a mighty long time. <clears throat> Right. Oh, right. It's haunting me. Yes. I'm not going to do it though because uh, that was the moment of weakness. You get real cheese from there. Yeah, I don't get something to explain that's like more real. Maybe it doesn't have kids in it.
Wow, that's crazy, man. Yeah, it is nice, actually. I mean, it's, it's hard to walk, but... Uh, All right, almost at Duke's Lane. I'm going to call it. Today's Chinatown excursion was cool. I'll be back down more there and do some more stuff there. Don't blame the teacher, blame the school. <laughs>